Coal has been so vital to us, it's been unbelievable. We should never forget who brung us to the dance. I mean, we went through about seven, eight years, uh, the entire Obama administration, seeing, uh, seeing uh, policy after policy aimed to curtail or cut back on, on coal production, coal consumption. Uh, so it was, uh, it was perhaps uh, coal's uh, darkest days uh, until Governor Justice took office. We should try with all of our soul, with all in us, to try to help get our miners back to work. I sat right at his desk in the Oval Office and said, Mr. President, what if this happens? New tonight, Governor Justice says he's the one that reached out to President Trump about designating coal as a national security interest. Justice and the President talked about the Trump Justice Coal Plan. Plan's probably been around now close to a year. You know, it was Governor Justice who uh, shared that whole concept with President Trump, who then ran with it. Justice says if the country relies solely on natural gas and shutters all its coal plants, a terrorist could attack a natural gas pipeline, crippling the country's power system. And he looked right at me and he said, God forbid it could happen, couldn't it? And if it did, the Eastern power grid would collapse and be collapsed for months. This whole plan is intended to incentivize Eastern coal production. The president has directed Energy Secretary Rick Perry to prepare immediate steps to stop the loss of coal. But that whole idea and concept uh, came uh, from, from right here with, uh, with Governor Justice. You know, we're entering a new time. President Trump and, and Governor Justice have teamed up uh, to do everything within their power, you know, to see those negative trends reverse. I'm happy to report to you that in 2017, coal production in the Mountain State jumped by over 16% compared to the previous year. Coal is coming back right here in the heartland of America. It is an absolute unbelievable thing to travel down through the coal fields and see communities coming back to life. And coal is coming back. And it's also coming back for another reason, national security. And your governor knows very well and your senator knows very well. Uh, we're seeing uh, new policies, new regulations uh, developed here. Every ton of coal brings more payroll, more suppliers, more everything. So. Uh, what's going on in the coal industry is very beneficial, as is any economic development. Uh, both President Trump and Governor Justice, uh, you know, have, have pledged that they're going to uh, put miners back to work. They, they understand the importance of this industry. They know what it means with respect to growing our industrial base to create all those service jobs out there within the economy. America is winning again because we're finally putting America first.